they said that UNIT will produce uh, life-saving drugs, uh, chemotherapy and uh, nutritional drugs uh, for the patients uh, across Lincolnshire. Uh, the impact on patients uh, will be that we can produce drugs for them uh, locally uh, in Lincolnshire. Uh, it will mean they're available to them in a more timely uh, manner. Uh, and for our staff, they get the opportunity to move from a uh, end-of-life modular building to this absolutely fantastic uh, brand new building uh, that's state-of-the-art. Uh, Science Park's the perfect location for us because producing these uh, drugs uh, can be done uh, off an acute hospital site uh, and done right in the heart of where education and research and learning is happening uh, and we're situated next to the School of uh, Pharmacy and Chemistry uh, which is really what we need to be uh, doing. When we designed the Bull Technology Centre we were very much aware that there was an absence of innovation appropriate space in Lincolnshire. So we designed it to be as, as flexible and as feature rich as we, as we possibly could so that we could create a huge variety of environments here, whether that be data centers, laboratories, engineering facilities. And that's allowed us to build this aseptic facility far more cheaply and more easily than otherwise would have been possible. Lincolnshire Co-op is built on collaboration and it's great that we started off with a collaboration between the University of Lincoln and the Co-op to come up with a concept of a science park for this area. And now, of course, we're joined by the ULHT, the Hospital Trust, who are bringing their innovation and their needs onto the science park to take it forward still further. The aseptic unit gives us an opportunity to work with partners in developing really uh, high-tech medicines. So we work with the Lincolnshire Cooperative, a great community pharmacy co company in Lincolnshire. We work with the local health services. Here we will develop the highest quality new medicines. We have fabulous researchers in medical sciences and drug development. They'll be working hand in glove with those partners to develop the medicines of the future.